Hi guys, so today I'm doing the I Heart full tag, which I think is perfect for the full time. It's basically showing you my favourites without really saying them in a completely other video. But this is my like full on go to stuff for full time. So let's get started. What is your favourite full lip product? Now I kind of cheated, I've got three. Um, I can never pick between these three colours because I just think they are all amazing. They are really really good to stay on your lips and really moisturising as well. This is the Kiss You obviously and this is Harry's one so um, excuse the packaging. The only thing I don't like about it is the packaging does get a bit dirty but it's just this really really lovely red that you can deepen up if you put it um, under the Liam one. This is the Liam one and it is Liam loves blueberries so I like to put maybe this underneath it and this on the middle of my lips and have a little bit of an ombre lip going on. The next one is this lip gloss here and I don't know why I really like this lip gloss because it's just a perfect plum colour. It is the Model Zone lip gloss and it is in pure plum. So it is really the perfect plum lip gloss. What is your favourite full nail polish? Okay, so my current favourite nail polish set is this and I know it's not full time at all. This is the UV polish set by W7. It's super cheap, super like pigmented. I've got them on my nails right now. I really love them. I've got that colour and that colour on. Um, but I really want to get the full colour, like the full set for full time but I have been using a lot of these like these two mainly because I just think they're quite nice full colours um because it's not quite winter yet but I really want to get the winter set so I can wear them all year round because I really do like them they're super cheap and I would recommend you pick them up the only thing I don't like about them is the first coat is like the worst so I was like oh my god this is going to be really bad nail polish but then the second coat is just amazing so i would really recommend what is your favorite starbucks drink for full mine i don't actually drink starbucks at all um shocker i'm like the only person on youtube that doesn't drink starbucks um i don't know why i just think i never go into town really that much to get it and i'm just not a big fan of all the calories that it has I'm main drinks most of the time so first of all i love these green teas by Tesco, they are very cheap and you get 20 in them and they last you for ages and they just, they're really, really good to detox your body and make your body just get rid of all the bad energy in it, all the bad chemicals in it. You may poo a bit, but it's okay. And I've also been loving these lattes from Aldi. They basically just look like that. They are just, oh, they're so amazing. You literally just have to pour it in and add water and just... They give you energy, they give you warmth, they give you coziness. If you have this with um, whipped cream and marshmallows, mm, or brandy sauce and marshmallows. What is your favourite full candle? I don't have candles, I don't burn them. Again, I'm like the only person on YouTube that doesn't. Um, I don't know, my mum doesn't really love the fact of candles in the house when she goes out and I'm in and then the house will go on fire because it's me. Um, two perfumes that I love in the fall because I don't use candles. Um, I love the Burberry Weekend one and it's just absolutely amazing. You need like two squirts of this and it smells just literally full. You can smell the Starbucks drinks in them even though I didn't drink Starbucks but I know what it smells like. You can smell the leaves, you can smell the wood, you can smell the campfire. I just absolutely love it and for the full time i know this is a bit weird but i really love the lady gaga one um i don't know what this is called but it's literally black ink you guys can see that it's black ink and i really 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 just love this smell if lady gaga was to smell like it is this what is your favorite full scarf or accessory okay so i have no scarves i am not the scarf hat person i'm just a a coat and um, woolly socks and go person and um, so i've got a couple of accessories for you and i do have a hat but it's more fashion than keep me warm and um, this one i have no idea where it's from it doesn't say on the back but it's this really cute pink watch and it's in the shape of an apple and i just think this is 
so cute but for like even if you're doing like a doll for halloween i just really really think this goes with any outfit and then you always have the time on you as well so i just think this is perfect for the halloween time and also just for styling really i also like the stuff like this for fall again i have no idea where i got this from well i actually did my sister boil it back from me when she went traveling um but it's just this love heart necklace that's got like wooden and then it's got blue beads around it and i absolutely love it for any styling like plain top this and it literally looks like you're not wearing a plain top part of the t-shirt and it's like a pop of color and it's really really good just to chuck on like um because at college we can wear um our school sh our college shirt and any necklace that we want on it to give it a nice color so i always wear this and i get thousands of compliments on it so i really think it's a nice antique but also unique and just from a different country so you know that no one else will have it well pretty much no one else will have it so i really do love it the next thing is some guys of you love me wearing this hat and some guys of you some of you guys hate it um this is the nyc um 89 hat and it is from primer and it's two pounds and it keeps your head warm and it gives any black outfit a color so again i like to wear this to college because um like on the way there we're not allowed to wear it at college but on the way there i like to wear it when i'm on the bus keeps me warm and it just doesn't look like i'm wearing all black so win-win absolutely love it i also have been liking this jumper and it's just a good old batman jumper i love wearing these in the full time with a dark lip and my hair down and black leggings or jeans and i'm good to go i absolutely love this i also love this one and it's just black and white striped and it's all fuzzy like furry fuzzy kind of material there you go you can see it i absolutely love this it's so warm i kind of like you can wear like pink leggings underneath it or pink jeans or just black with it and it still gives it a pop of color because of the white base so i absolutely love it haunted house hayride or corn maze now here in england it's crap on halloween literally we have all we have in the town is some scary monsters walking around like a week before halloween and the uh, some kind of lights but not really um so yeah it's really bad in our town we have no house ride um haunted house we have no hayride what we have ha <sighs> Uh, we have no haunted house we have no hayride and we have no corn maze so i have never been in one of them but i have been in a haunted house and i crapped my pants and i'm never doing it again so i'm saying no to them one and a maybe to the other two because i've never done the other two but when i was in disneyland like a couple of years ago near halloween i went in there worst mistake of my life because i get scared so easily and all of my friends will be like oh it'll be so funny i'll be like yeah for you watching me poop my pants yeah not for me i'll have nightmares for about two weeks what is your favorite fall or halloween movie okay so these is it these this yeah these aren't fall or halloween but i always get them out near them times one of them is actually a christmas one so it's the night there before christmas I watch this on Christmas, I watch it on Halloween, I watch it whenever I have a reason to watch it basically. This film is so good, I love singing along to it, which I don't think my neighbours love, but I love. And yeah, I just love this film, I think it's very cheeky, it's a cheeky film. And the next one is just an all time classic and it is kind of freaky in a way if you look at it. Um, and it is Little Shop of Horrors, I really want to go and see this in the West End because I think it will be really good or on a live show somewhere because i just think it would be really good what is your favorite candy to eat on halloween now we don't have very many good candies aren't we? we don't have candy corn we don't have pretty much crap stuff we don't have reese's bunnies or the bunnies we don't have reese's we don't have any well actually we just started to get reese's now we don't have any flaming oreos apart from double stuffed and the normal ones of what i know and maybe the orange ones which no. um but i just like the good old chocolate bar kit kat milky way and i do like me some harry bow oh my favorite sweets of all time though is them little rainbow drops if i don't know if they have them in the um usa and things like that but they're little rainbow drops from what i know i don't think you do but i'll try and get a photo off of them now they are 
my favourite sweets of all time. I don't know why. They're just plain, plain sugar puffs. I don't know. I just love them. What are you dressing up for for Halloween? Now, I am 17. So, we don't really... I don't really go trick or treating anymore. I went trick or treating last year and I think that was my last time. But I thought if my friends are going to have a party or my family's going to have a party, they were thinking about everyone dressing up, which I think will be absolutely hilarious seeing my nan in a Halloween costume. Please come and do it just for the Facebook photos because it will be hilarious. Um, but if we do end up having a party, um, and I am doing a collab on the month with Luzzy with this, and I don't know if it's up yet or it's been up yet, but if it is, I'll link it down below. Um, it is a doll, like, um, kind of creepy doll, but kind of cute doll at the same time. And, yeah, I just think the doll is a nice, easy, safe way to go. Because it's main, it's normal makeup, but a bit more, just more pigmented. You have to have a showing, apart from the stitches on your face. But I just think, it's everyone knows who you are if you have the right outfit. And... I just think, like, you can wear any outfit with it with a doll's face. I mean, everyone will know. With the cheeks and the the lips, everyone will know. And the eyes, and they will just know that you're a doll. So I think that is the safe option to go. It's easy to do and very quick and, yeah, a doll. What is your favourite thing about the full time? The last question, and my favourite thing about the full time is probably... It's getting closer to Christmas, getting closer for me to um, listen to Michael Bublé's Christmas album um, because it's not acceptable to do that all year round and I wish it was. And all the YouTubers do I Heart Full Tags which I'm obsessed with watching and also I tag Lozzy and you guys to do this by the way. Um, and I just like all the leaves on the floor as well and getting into your warm bed and watching probably Jeremy Carl but yeah. Okay guys, that was it. I hope you guys enjoyed. Don't forget to like this video if you like more tags. Again, I tag Lozzy and everyone else to do it. Please leave it down below because I'm obsessed with watching these. So I will literally watch all of them. I'm obsessed with it. So please, can you comment, like link it down below because I just love watching them. Um, so yeah, don't forget to like, comment and subscribe. And I will see you guys later. Goodbye. Now twerk like Miley Cyrus. I tell you.